to know that consumers really want to have a motorcycle which suits their long distance riding needs which nowadays a lot of people are doing and combines it with the everyday practical use which is quite quite imperative across the globe it has the cruiser characteristics but it's got the proportions and the geometry to work on indian roads Suspension performance and, and chassis geometry was very important with this project because uh, to get all those elements, um, to get a bike that is well balanced. We do a lot of simulations uh, forehand to, to help the best possible combination or the best possible configuration to start off in the first place. It's got a, a more rigid frame, which is better for the stability, and it means we can be a bit more generous with the geometry of the bike, which helps keep it very nimble while still stable at high speeds. Development of this seat, um, from the base, the foam, the covering, all the way up through the whole process, the ergonomics, the grips, the shape of the bars here, every part of that has been focused on trying to maintain the comfort for the customer so you can definitely uh, munch up the miles on this bike. The physical tests uh, start uh, both in-house within our technical facilities in India and the UK and also on the roads in, in different geographies. It's put to multiple type of tests, millions of kilometers on the roads, tested by different type of people as well. I think that eclectic mix of riders and and the experiences that we've got in Royal Enfield has come up with exactly the right thing. I stand back and look at it. It's, it's, it's a great looking motorbike, it really is.